What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I got a new ride and review for you today. I'm going to uh, a Greek restaurant called Papa's. Papa's is um, it's out on McDougal Street in the West Village. I'm currently on Fifth Avenue in Midtown. It's a little bit hectic here with traffic. I'm going to meet the cake dealer for dinner. Um, as I said, this place is a Greek restaurant. Uh, they have a lot of like traditional Greek dishes like fish, um, lamb, things like that. Uh, but they also have a pretty hefty steak menu. So I'm going to be a little bit torn on what I want to order. It's, um, yeah, come on, it's traffic. It's going to be tough for me to decide, as I was saying. There's a, there's a good deal of steak on this menu. So I'm thinking either they have like a porterhouse for two. I'm thinking either that or we get uh, two separate entrees, maybe like um, a lamb shank and a fish. Because I know like this is a, a pretty notable Greek restaurant. It's been there for a while. And Greek restaurants usually have really great fish and lamb dishes, especially lamb shank with orzo. It's um, it's always nice. Or so couscous. So it looks like I got a little bit of a green wave here. I'm riding in the bus lane because the regular lanes are a little bit insane right now. Just passing by the public library on 5th Ave and 42nd. I've got a new GoPro with the media mount. I have the Hero 10. And I've got the media mod mount on it. So I'm hoping that the audio is a little better, less wind noise. The video should be a lot more steady too because I'm actually, I'm on the Ultraflex now. And the Ultraflex has dual front and rear suspension so the ride is smoother I'm jumping less on bumps so I think it's gonna translate to a better ride a video experience overall let's see so let's see where am I at here 35th I still got a ways to go The Ultraflex, the new Zoos bike UF1200, is currently on super sale for $500 off of what they normally ask. It's $32.95. And I think this is going to be a new regular price because you can stack my coupon code on it. You can use code Johnny Prime and get an additional $150 off the $32.95, so you come down to like $31.45. It's a pretty great deal for this bike. AKA the competition killer. It really is, it's better than anything in its class. Coming down into the NYU area. Getting close to Papa's. Just crossed over 12th Street. I'm basically taking this down until it hits uh, Washington Square Park and then, and then making a right. So I think we're up to like number 90 or 88, 88 or 90 riding review. We got so many. This is getting crazy. Crazy. Got a maneuver. BMX, Zeus, Freedom, Control. 
get right around all the nonsense. What a view, right? Take this right here. So, Papa's is right on McDougal. I just gotta take the next left. And then I think it's just up ahead on the left. I'm hungry, I'm ready to eat. Definitely ready for some good Greek food. I've heard good things about this place. A lot of, uh, a lot of other food Instagrammers have been coming here. And it looks great. But like I said, I don't know if I should get steak, fish, lamb. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be a tough choice. Maybe I'll just get all of it. All right. All right. See you on the inside. Cocktails have arrived. Cheers. This is gonna be tough. To... Oh. Uh, uh. Bread. It's perfectly cooked. Yeah. The rosemary in there? That is an impressive dish. It's so soft, it's falling right off. Look at that. <laughs> it's so soft and tender. This is the orange custard. And then, baklava. Damn, look at that. All right, so Papa's Taverna. Great meal. Uh, we started off with some nice cocktails. I had like a, um, a little riff on a martini. It had vodka gin and some other stuff and a little like lemon oil on top. That was cool. My wife had some uh, Greek inspired spritz. Then um, we started with uh, Papa's chips, which are like eggplant and um, zucchini sliced real thin and fried. They weren't as crispy as I thought they were gonna be, but they were still really good. Came with a nice uh, tzatziki sauce. You know, yogurt, garlic, herbs. And then um, that grilled octopus was probably one of the best I've had. It was so tender, so flavorful, came with some hummus and uh, fried capers, just really delicious. Um, we decided to do um, the lamb shank and an individual size steak, the ribeye, 
22 ounce boneless was nicely cooked, good flavor on there. No dry age, but no matter. It was really tender, juicy, flavorful. Um, the lamb shank with orzo was the showstopper and the winning dish. It was so flavorful. Man, it fell right off the bone. You saw in the video, it's just like so tender, came right off. Amazing. Then uh, for dessert, we did um, baklava and this orange uh, custard. It was in a crepe, you know, not a crepe, uh, filo dough. Both were really good. The, um, the baklava was a shock, was a surprising one for me because usually it's too sweet. Uh, but that wasn't the case here. It was nicely balanced, not too sweet. A lot of great crispy phyllo dough layers. And that goes for both desserts, the um, custard and the baklava. And they were both really big portion size wise too. Definitely get your value uh, at this place. And I would recommend it for sure. It's really fancy inside. It's beautifully decorated. They do, um, they do like private parties and stuff. They have big rooms downstairs. They have belly dancers at night, a DJ, fire dancers, really cool stuff. It's part of um, Dream Hospitality, you know, the Dream Hotel, really nice hotel chain, high-end stuff. So it's a good spot. But as usual, you know, jump out to the website, johnnyprimesteaks.com for the full review, the full write-up, all the pictures, all the details. Make sure you like, subscribe, tell your family, tell your friends, and tell your fucking grandma.